Hi, it's Gene, retired in Mexico, and we ask one question on this channel, which is, do they write them and sing them like they used to? Now, a lot of people, young and old, they think the old music is better, but I'm not so sure. And today, we're going to hit up a poll winner, and I was surprised, because Ice Peak was winning for a long time, and all of a sudden, Komodo Khan and Komodo Gantz, Komodo Gantz and Khan one and they're a british dj super group so we'll go ahead and hit this up i think i might have this on mute i apologize guys i do that sometimes and uh do i have yeah i got it on mute you know i do that a lot and i'm sorry about that and the other thing uh, that got me a little distracted here i want to introduce you guys to uh somebody here some of you who are newer on the channel but uh this little guy here, let me pull this guy here. He, um, this little guy here, Henry, he unplugged my ring light. Say hi to everybody, Henry. <laughs> He's not too thrilled. But anyway, I, I was like, what happened to my light? And uh, I looked and he unplugged it. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> He's 16 years old, so he's looking a little scrawny, but uh, let's go ahead and hit this up. Um, I'm anxious to hear this, and here we go. And thanks you, thanks you guys for voting. So we had 56 votes so far. I figured that was probably enough to declare a winner, but we'll, we'll go ahead and do another one from that poll. So here we go. Mm. Mm. It's going to be dubstep. Mm. Some pitch variations here, pitch shifting going on. Okay. Pitch shifting, and this song is called AMK. Mm. briefly because I, I don't know if they're going to block this but uh yeah right away it reminds me so very early it reminded me you guys know i'm a if you've watched the channel i'm a burial fan so i you know i heard those vocal samples and even before the dubstep came in but then i'm hearing these low um 
sounds that remind me of Benga that I like a lot, uh, a guy from England that does those uh, rumbling uh, kind of synth bass hits. I'm not sure what you would call them, but so I'm getting those. But then you got like what sounded like movie dialogue and then you got the Mid-Eastern thing going in. This is a, a busy track, but I think what's most surprising to me is that it's mid-tempo. You know, I'd expected something either with a faster beat or a slower beat, something ambient. So I like that it's mid-tempo. I actually don't hear enough mid-tempo music. So let's keep going on this. This is cool. Love sound collages. That Mid Eastern again. Bass is thumping hard. Okay, I think what I need to do here is, I like this track quite a bit. I was only going to do one song, but let me go ahead and pause the video and let's bring up a second song called Bitchcraft uh, from the same album and we'll play that and, and that'll give me a clue as to the variety of styles that these guys may or may not employ. So I'm going to go, I'll be right back and we'll do this. Okay, and so here's the song Bitchcraft. I switched my stuff around, hope that's okay. All right, here we go. Kind of mid-tempo again.
That female vocal really, really added a lot. Nice effect. for the headphones. Oh, cool. Well, I like this quite a bit. You know what I'm thinking, though? As much as I like this, I'm thinking, like, where do you play this? It, it's not exactly club music, I don't think. Uh, and maybe driving. Maybe this would be good in the car. Because uh, I can't imagine playing it working or... Or, 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 to re, or to relax or anything else like that, but it does sound like pretty good music for the car. Yeah, I think that's where I would play it, is driving. Uh, good stuff. Uh, I mentioned Benga. He has an album called, uh, I think it's called Diary of an Electric Warrior. Something, no, or Diary of an African Warrior. And uh, I prefer that album, honestly. It's just got sonics that I prefer. Uh, to this, so I like this quite a bit. Um, but if I compare it to Burial or Benga or some of the other dubstep and British DJ type things that I've listened to, you know, I, I have to be honest, I have preference for those particular artists. And these guys drop into the, you know, third or fourth slot. Uh, so there's nothing wrong with this music. I liked it. Appreciate you guys turning me on to it. Um, love the samples, love the Mid Eastern influence and uh yeah i think you know just comparing it i'd have to give this an a minus i hope that's okay with you guys it means i liked it a lot anything that's an a is something that i really like so yeah i would play this again it's um yeah yeah it was uh, and i like the mid tempo i really like the mid tempo that's probably my, probably my favorite thing about it uh, a lot of electronic music is either very ambient, like you think of, uh, why did I just space out his name? You know, Richard James. What's his name? Starts with an A. A uh, Aphex Twin. You know, something that's very ambient like that, or something that's really hyper. And these guys play that mid-tempo, at least based on these two songs, and I love that a lot. So, thank you for the recommendation. I thought it was cool. It was great in the earphones. and. Yeah, I could see playing this in, in the car when you've got good good stereo inside your car. You got some back speakers or something, and got some good bass in there. This would be perfect. So, thank you for the recommendation. And 
if you like what we're doing here, a senior reacting to the new music of the 21st century, we don't do anything pre-2000 here, except on very special occasions or to reference this or that or as it might inform something else. So that's it. And as we say here, and what I was going to say is hit that like or subscribe button. It really helps. And as we say here in Mexico, buen dia.